Hey, welcome to my channel. My name is Exquisite. Today's topic is on haters. You got to watch who is happy for you in your chaos. And you got to see who's happy for you when you win it. I have noticed that you can find out who your biggest haters are on social media. Especially Facebook, shall I say. Man. My thing is, why do people choose to go sit on people's social media and not support anything that they have going on, like anything, this, that, that, this, and one other? But the minute somebody say, oh, somebody died, somebody's, you know, something bad happening, all this and all that, or something stupid, it can be the most stupidest comment uh memes or however and here comes somebody that you ain't seen comment post or nothing in a long time or you'll you know you know they on there because i don't like to give my the way i know that people are really really big 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 social media lurkers and haters but i'm gonna let you know watch that green light in messenger I cannot tell you how many times I've posted something just so I can go on there and make sure that that I'm deleting the right person. You go straight on there, especially in a story. You go post something in your story, your first biggest hater is going to be the first one to come view it. That's how they get themselves deleted, not knowing. On top of you post something, go to that messenger, check that green box, look at that green box. I guarantee you, your hater is going to be sitting on there first. Post something positive, all oh, they ain't going to say nothing. All they sitting over there doing on the outside is, oh, she thinking she all this, she thinking she all that, and just worried about what you used to do. That I'm, That's the first thing they'll go tell somebody what you used to do. Yes, I am going back to school at 38 years old. So be it. No, I, I didn't. I said I was never, ever going back to school because my patience was very, very, very short. That was the, the main thing. My patience was short for all that and sitting and then computers and all this and all that. Now, now I have no choice because the fields that I want to get in, it requires school. It And that's what I noticed, that it requires school. And not the same the fields that I have, I've uh, already accomplished, like driving buses, that was one of my goals. I've already did that without a high school diploma. Straight out of, I was 18 years old, going down there, signing myself up to start for late law. So I think it was first student or something like that, late law. It was late law back then. And 19, I got them licensed. And when I tell you, I never heard nothing good about myself. Only everything everybody will say is, oh, she was a team mom. She was a team mom. She was a team mom. Now, I'm so tired of hearing that. Like, really go yourself at this point. That's where I'm at with that. So I don't want to hear that no more from nobody. Let's, let's, let's just go there. And another thing, please stop being a hater. If you don't... um agree with someone or you're not feeling them and all that, why go sit on their Facebook? Why go sit on their social media, their TikTok, their this, their that, their this and that? I don't have nobody sitting on my social medias that I do not agree with. Trust and believe that. And trust and believe I don't care who gets mad if I delete them and block them because I don't want all that here come oh I, I didn't see you in a long time and all this extra stuff and it's like what do you mean you ain't seen me in a long time you ain't you ain't been looking for me you know like you ain't you haven't been looking for me you've been lurking that's what you've been doing lurking on the low that's really what's been going on and when you bring that to people's attention, I mean, they get so butthurt. Or another thing, let me tell you how you know you got Facebook lurkers. You'll post something positive and they won't comment on it. 
But the minute they see you, they be, oh, I see that you, you know, you start school, you're doing this, you're doing that. Oh, hey, girl. But not saying how many people you didn't call, talked about it too, before you seen me, had your own opinions and some more stuff. And it's like, oh, you seen that? Oh, but you couldn't comment? But you wait until you see me to to um acknowledge it, you're deleted. And I'll tell them that straight in their face. Thank you for letting me know that you're a Facebook lurker. Because that's one of my biggest things that I hate is for somebody, somebody to be sitting there watching somebody, going back, telling, you know, their own part of the story. Does the story don't even be halfway it? They go back and tell their part of the story, but they ain't gonna tell you about their business. Trust and believe. And if they had business, they wouldn't even be able to go back running, telling you about the next person business. So I'm just here to say, make sure that you be aware of your surroundings and the people that support you through your bulls, your madness, and the people that support you through your accomplishments, leveling up in life. And I'm telling you, you'll see a big, big difference. And we living in a cold, cold world. And we got to stay woke, stay humble, and stay prayed up most of all. Talk to you next time.